What's cracking YouTube? My name's Brody and welcome to my first TCBM video. So just recently I actually organized a trade with another YouTuber that is in Australia. His name, um, his channel name is Pokemon. It'll be linked in the description of the video. But yeah, so we actually did a huge trade. It started off just being a couple of cards and I was kind of just like, yeah, I want this one as well. And this one. And this one. And we ended up doing like a, I think it was like a 9 ultra rare uh, kind of trade. Um, but yeah, so it's in today's video, what I'm going to be showing to you guys is what I traded for. And then I'll leave a link in the description to his side of the video so you can see what I traded him to get this stuff. Um, but yeah, um, for you guys that don't know, TCBM actually stands for Traded Cards by Mail. <laughs> <coughs> oh, sorry about that, guys. I'm a little bit sick, but let's get into this um, little package. Hopefully, I don't cut through anything. Let's just see. Okay, it doesn't look like there's anything there to cut into. But let's see what this contains, because I know we were um, throwing in a uh, signature card and some extras as well. But awesome. So that is everything. Excellent, excellent, excellent. So let's have a look at what we have here today. Awesome. So we got some of the trade, 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 <laughs> trade, trade, more trade. Awesome. Awesome. Oh, sweet. Alrighty, so let's start off with this. Sorry about that, guys. Um, so we have, we have, we have the signature, si signature card. It's pretty sick, but see, you can see his channel name, Pokemon, and then we got, um, I think that's his name. I believe that is his name in his little signature. But cool. Cool, cool, cool. So I'll throw that one at the back. What else do we have? We have a new, um, what do you call that, that your DS kind of giveaway card. I believe this one, it says there, 1st of the 24th, but I believe down here, it actually says... <coughs> oh, sorry guys. Um, this code must be redeemed by the 31st of May. Just... There. But yeah, so, um, it's still valid and useful. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I will redeem that one for sure. For sure, for sure. But yeah, so now let's get into the trade side of things. So let's, um sort this out. I might I might quickly have a fast forward section here to get everything out of the top load so we can have a nice um look in the light of these of these cards. So I'll be back in a sec guys. Alrighty guys and we're back. Sorry about that. That took a little bit longer than expected. Uh, but 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 we are back. So this here is a so what I'm gonna going to do is kind of explain um as to what kind of went down with the trade. But um, this this Venusaur here was a well just a random EX because um, we kind of had like a little because how we based this trade was off troll and trade pricing so we went okay these cards are worth this much so if I put these two cards it actually equals the value of this this card over here kind of thing so we pretty much pictured the cards as money and that's how we based this trade uh, but yeah so. This Venus right here was actually just a. I just said, uh, just give me a random EX to kind of cover the um, cover the gap for gap difference between a couple of cards. But yeah, so this was a, a bonus kind of uh, EX, I guess you could say. So not even bad. It's a Venus right EX with 180 HP with Poison Powder and Jungle Hammer. I believe this one is a promo from the Kanto uh, Kanto Trio tins. So definitely a nice nice little card. Let's throw that one at the back there. Awesome. So now we're on to the actual, I guess you say actual side of the trade. Um, so the rest of these cards, I believe, oh well, there's a couple that aren't. But um, these are actually cards that I needed for my sets themselves, okay? So this Rayquaza EX I actually needed for my Roaring Skies, um, Roaring Skies set, which was awesome to get my hands on. Um, I also managed to get my hands on the energy switch from Roaring Skies as well, secret rare energy switch, which is awesome, awesome, awesome. 
And then, moving on to Ancient Origins, I got the Emperor TX Full Art, so yeah, I need this one for my set as well. This Mega Tita here was actually a bonus I just kind of wanted just because it was just Mega Tita and it looks sick. It looks absolutely sick. So let's throw that one up the back as well. Mega Sceptile EX, once again, just another card that I needed and it just looks amazing as well. Like if if I already had it, I definitely would have traded for this, it, just in general, because it looks awesome. It looks absolutely awesome. But then we got the Secret Rare Trainer's Mail as well from Ancient Origins as well. I believe this was the last card I needed um, out of the two Secret Rares in Ancient Origins. So then we got the Mega Houndoom EX Full Art from Breakthrough. And as some of you guys may, may know, I've already completed Breakthrough, but... Um, this card is just, it just looks so good. The art is amazing and it's definitely going to have a place up on my little back display wall. Definitely, definitely. Probably Me Mega Tita and this card will um, go on the back display. But then, 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 of course, of course, if I see a Dark Rye, I gotta trade for that Dark Rye. So we got this Dark Rye, which is pretty sweet. Pretty sweet. I actually pulled this one in one of my recent uh, Boost Box openings as well. So. That's always a nice bonus. Nice bonus, so let's throw that up there as well. <coughs> Hoa EX Full Art. Awesome card once again. I traded for this one purely based off art. I've actually actually already pulled this one as well. But I can never have too many of these these cards. It just looks amazing. Looks amazing. And then of course, of course, once again, I saw a Dark Rai and I had to trade for it. No questions asked. And check that card. God damn, I love it. <laughs> love it, love it, love it. And the final card of this trade, I actually had to trade my Skylar Full Art, Skylar Bay for this card. But it was all worth it. It was all worth it because it is, in fact, the Secret Rare Full Art Silver Dialga EX. So, yeah, this card eluded me throughout all my off-cam Phantom, Phantom Forces booster box openings. Same with this, uh, the Mega Gengar Secret Rare. But yeah, what a shiny, shiny card. Check that out. It was very hard for um, Pokemon to, uh, I guess you'd say, organize a trade for this, this card, being, uh, being the prize, I guess you'd say, of his kind of um, side collection. In the trade binder, it was um, very tough to get off his hands, but I managed to do it. And yeah, so that is the whole trade. So uh, recapping the trade, we got the signature card. We got Meryl, Meryl the signature signature card. So I'll throw that one away in in a new binder. Um, we got a mythical Mew promo card, like the um, in-game promo card. So I'll be sure to redeem that one as well. Who knows? I might even do it on cam and. We will see, we will see. But yeah, then we got the whole trade. Like, check this out. What a huge, huge trade. So how many cards is that? We got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 cards in this trade. Wow, wow, wow. But yeah, that is the whole trade with Pokemon. So I'll be sure to leave a link to 222, his video in the description of the video so you guys can see what I traded him and yeah good times good times ahead um be sure to like the video if you guys enjoyed today's TCBM my first TCBM drop a comment in the comment section below and let me know what your favorite card is out of all the cards that I received today 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 so that gives you a brief idea of what I got but yeah, let me know in the comment section below, and I'll see you guys in another one of my Pokemon trading card game openings. Thanks for watching. Peace.